Pedro Martinez fell short of a perfect game when he surrendered a double in the 10th inning. Hi, everybody. This is Short Shots. What happened this week in sports history? Martinez pitched a one-hitter in a 10-inning complete game. one nothing shutout against the Padres in San Diego. Bip Roberts got the only hit leading off the bottom of the 10th. That happened on June 3rd, 1995. One day later, and 21 years earlier, June 4th, 1974, exactly 50 years ago this week, it was 10 cents beer night at the, this place, the biggest ballpark in the major leagues at that time, Cleveland's old municipal stadium, trailing the Texas Rangers 6-3, 5-3. The fans became unruly, but in the bottom of the ninth, the Indians scored two runs to tie the game, and Cleveland still had runners on first and third with two outs when things got out of hand. Two fans rushed out on the field to attack the Rangers right fielder, Jeff Burroughs. As Burroughs attempted to fight them off, others stormed the field. Players from both teams tried to rescue Burroughs, but they found themselves in an all-out melee of intoxicated fans while bottles were flying from every direction. Security was unable to clear the field. The umpires had no choice but declare the game a forfeit to Texas. Mother of God! Needless to say, it was the last 10 cents beer night in Major League Baseball history. Finally, if you answer this question, you are a genius. However, I do believe not one viewer will know this. Who won the final USFL championship? Who cares? But the answer is the Baltimore Stars beat the Oakland Invaders 20-24 around this time in 1985. It was the final game of the United States Football League that lasted for two seasons. Thanks for watching. Till next time, be a good sport. Stay loose.